The state of Chelsea in the 90s will shock you. Before the glitz and glamour of Premier League and Champions League trophies, Chelsea were a side struggling to make ends meet, often closer to relegation than they were the title. As revealed by former Chelsea and England manager Glenn Hoddle, their training ground was a disgrace and wasn't even fully owned by them. Cricket and hockey teams also used the facilities, meaning the players couldn't even train on all days of the week. There were no offices, no gym and not even any baths. He also expressed his his concern about the culture of the club at the time, noting that some players went off to McDonald's after training sessions. And when trying to negotiate a big player deal, he had to do so with an old style payphone, constantly putting 50p into it so he could continue negotiating. An entirely different club to the Chelsea we now know.